हेलो ओल सो लेट स्टार्ट द सेकेंड एपिसोड अबाउट यंग नरेन एट स्कूल एंड एट प्ले वेन ही वॉज सिक्स ईयर्स ओल्ड नरेन बिगेन हिज स्टडीज ही डिन गो टू स्कूल एट फर्स्ट एज हिज पेरेंट्स गॉट अ टीचर फॉर हिम ही क्विकली लर्न टू रीड एंड राइट हिज मेमरी वॉज वेरी गुड एंड ही कुड अंडरस्टैंड अ लेसन आफ्टर हियरिंग हिज टीचर रीड इट वंस When he was seven, Narain was sent to a metropolitan institution, and the school was started by Pandit Ishwar Chandra Vidya Sagar. Narendra Nath was very intelligent and learned his lessons quickly. He became a leader among the boys. He enjoyed games very much. He would eat his lunch quickly and would be the first to run to the playground. Some of his games were jumping, running, boxing, and playing with marbles. Sometimes he invented new games. Sometimes Narain turned the classroom into a playground. He would talk to his friends and tell them stories even while the teacher was present. Once the teacher saw them talking, he turned to Narain and his friends and asked them. to repeat the lesson all were silent except narain who was able to listen to the lesson in talking to his friends at the same time he was able to answer correctly all the questions put by the teacher then the teacher asked them who had been talking the boys pointed to narain the teacher didn't believe and made them stand up as a punishment narain stood up also the teacher told told him that he need not stand but he continued to do so he said i must for it was i was who was talking one of narain's favorite games was king and court Narain of course was always the king the court was held on a flight of stairs leading from the courtyard to the worship room Narain took the highest step for his royal throne he would then appoint his officials one boy would be made prime minister and another the commander in chief of the armies some were made to beauty princes or other government officers then they took their places on the lower steps according to their rank in this way narain the king held the court as king he gave orders settled disputes or put down rebellions no one was allowed to disobey the king's orders Sometimes he would order severe punishment to be given to a supposed rebel. The rebel would try to escape but the king's men would chase him around the house and would finally capture him amidst much noise and excited shouting. Narain liked animals very much and he would play with his fam- the family cow. He also cared pet animals and birds. Among these were a monkey, a goat, a peacock, some pigeons. The coachman was a special friend of Narain, and he would often be found having intimate talks with him. Narain also thought that the size or groom was a very grand person. He said. in front of the carriage wearing a big turban and swinging a hip narain sometimes said that when he grew up he would like to be a size he tried his hand at many games once in a while he played at cooking also he bought vegetables and spices and cooked various dishes he was really a good cook another time he organized a group of boys to a stage to stage plays then he became interested in physical exercise he first started a gymnasium in his own courtyard 
and later joined the gymnasium of a neighbor. He took lessons in fencing, lati play, wrestling, and other sports. Once, Narain and his friends were trying to set up a heavy trapeze. It was a difficult job for young boys. But, though many people gathered to watch, no one offered to help them. Narain noticed a strong British sailor in the crowd. He went to him and asked him to help them. The sailor agreed. He started to help them. But suddenly the trapeze slipped and hit the sailor. He fell down unconscious. Most of the people thought the sailor had been killed and run away from the scene. But Narain and one of or two of his friends stayed to help the sailor. Narain tore his thoti to make bandages. He bandaged the wound and the then sprinkled water on the sailor's face and fanned him gently. After some time, the sailor regained consciousness. Narain then helped him to go to a neighboring schoolhouse where he could stay and then sent for a doctor. After a while, the sailor recovered and went away. Before he left, Narain collected some money from his neighbors and gave it to the sailor. That's it for today. The rest will be continued. Thank you. If you liked it, then please like, share, subscribe and comment below. Thank you so much.